Let's see how you can use a custom watermark in your Word documents. It could be anything from your company's logo to your school's logo or any image or text that you'd like to use as your document's watermark. Now from the page layout tab, the page background section, click on watermark. As you can see here right out of the box you have a number of options, confidential, do not copy, draft sample, ASAP urgent. Let's try this one. As you can see it's quite easy to insert one of the ready watermarks. Let's remove this from here, watermark, remove watermark and let's see how I can use a custom watermark in our document. As you can see here, click on watermark, custom watermark. We have two options, we can use a picture watermark. Let's select a picture. Let's use this picture right here. You can set the scale and you can check the option here whether you'd like your picture watermark to appear washed out or not. Let's see the effect in action. This is washed out. This is with a washout option unchecked. And you can set the scale from 50% right up to 500% or auto. Let's select 500% and as you can see here, our watermark covers our entire page. So this is how I can use a picture watermark. Now let's remove our watermark and let's use some text as our custom watermark. As you can see here, you can set the language, the text that you'd like to use. This is a custom watermark. You can change the font. Let's use Cambria. The size from auto to 36 points right up to 144. Whether you'd like your watermark to appear semi-transparent or not. See the difference here. And you can also change the color green or any other color you'd like to use. You can also change the layout from diagonal to horizontal. As you can see here. And this is how you can use a custom watermark in your Word documents.